to a new vlog. We just made it to Verona, Italy. Spent the last two days in Treviso celebrating my friend's wedding, which was so lovely. And my boyfriend and I are vacationing one night in Verona at this like beautiful vineyard hotel. It's so beautiful. I'll show you around later. But we just got here. We're gonna go have some lunch now. Um, and I'll take you around the city. Should be a nice, nice 24 hours. Julian is insisting we go with the local rose, <laughs> which is a little scary. <laughs> Thank you. As you heard, <laughs> we're going for a coffee now. We've just made it to Lago di Garda for a quick pit stop before we make it to Germany. Oh yeah, I was supposed to take a flight from Milan to Vienna today, but there are strikes going on in the trains. And I was staying in Verona, so there's no way of getting to Milan from Verona, so Julian is driving me all the way to Germany so I can take the train from Germany to Vienna. So a bit of a change of plans, but a little more of a relaxed travel day, therefore. The view is over there, <laughs> the camera's over there. <laughs> one week I'm remote working I'm really just like here to check in on my family and like just be home again it's been three years time goes by so fast um, and I missed Vienna and I missed my coffee shops and my friends and my like great cousins and yaddy yaddy so that's what we're here for so I'm still working after work New York hours so I'm working from 3 p.m. to 11 p.m. and that works out pretty fine for me because I'm more of like a night owl than I am a morning person anyway so instead of wake up and go straight to work, I just go work and then go straight to bed. It works. 
I like it, I don't mind. But yes, it's Tuesday today, I arrived early yesterday. I was in Italy before this for a wedding, and I vlogged a little bit, but it is somebody else's wedding, <laughs> so I don't wanna like be there sticking a camera in my face. So it was me and my boyfriend, we went to Treviso, had a lovely, lovely wedding there. Um, and then we spent one night in Verona at this beautiful like vineyard hotel which I highly highly recommend and I'll link down below. Okay, so I have some exciting things. I'm working on a fun story for InStyle um, about Vienna and something here. Uh, so I also have to kind of do some research on that. Um, but since this is technically day one for me, I'm gonna go to my favorite coffee shops, do a little shopping, write down my thoughts, try to organize the story that I'm about to work on. I'm pretty sure I can't work on it during my actual work hours since there's so much that I have to do for my like day-to-day -day job. Um, and this is kind of like a side project that I'm working for them. So um, yes, should be fun. I'll take you guys along what it's like to be in my home area in Vienna. I'm currently staying at my friend's place. Um, normally I go stay at my cousin's, but he, lives a little like on the outskirts of Vienna and then he has an apartment in the middle of Vienna but that apartment doesn't have Wi-Fi and because I'm working Wi-Fi is kind of essential so my friend's letting me crash at her place which is just like beautiful she like has a casual four terraces which is like insane Groceries, and this is a quick grocery haul of what I always get in Vienna. Ketchup flavored pom bam. Jumpy. Katzlebach Kreifwurst. Oh, and they didn't have my uh, cereal either. Oh, I got this in the supermarket. Yeah. I'm Lula from my, the other day. Extra wurst. Key. Key. Mama Schnitten. Fruchtzwerge. I love it. Knabanassi. More beef sticks. Just got some tomatoes and Vogelsalat, which we for some reason do not have in the US, but is key. Bananas and bread. Yeah. Gonna make a quick lunch and then get back to work. I used to get in all confused. Give me a minute, let me dilute. I don't know why I tried so hard to stay on your radar in your orbit.
Hello, okay, I have been so crap at filming, but it's really only because I've been so in the moment and enjoying just being home and like smelling everything and seeing everything and being with family and it's just been so wholesome and nice. I've made it to my, I don't know what they're called, second cousins, great cousins, they're like my dad's cousin's family, this is like the house that I always come to when I come to Vienna. I featured it in my last two Vienna vlogs as well. I'm working from home here. I spent the morning with them having lunch and then at their pool. Can't complain about this work spot. Yeah, super nice. But uh, I'm just gonna keep continuing on in this. It's Prime Day, so it's all work, no play right now. And then once this is over tomorrow, it's like we're going Ham on Vienna content, so stay tuned. Dreams, I see the Alright, we made it back to the city of Vienna. I have a long day scheduled today, so get excited for some cute Vienna content. But first I have to conduct an interview for a story that I'm writing for InStyle. So we're gonna head over into the inner city and do that. And then we're gonna do some shopping. I have some friends to meet. I'm not late, but if I leave now, it'll be like perfect. So let's go. Suddenly it occurs to me 